the Women's Spirituality Program here at CIS was founded by uh, women who identified with the second wave of feminism. And um, one of their primary questions was really what happens uh, when women put their own experience at the center of their spirituality. As the program has evolved and developed over time, we've broadened a lot more to look at a, a broader group of women from many, many different um, ethnic and religious uh, backgrounds. And I think that um, the conversations just become that much richer. How do we actually empower women and create change in a positive way? The effect of patriarchy is multi-layered. Somehow women have been oppressed by religion. We really want to rebalance the world and bring the sacred feminine forward. Justice, what does justice mean? What is truth? What is reality? What is right? What is wrong? We can reimagine it in a different way. Justice is our movement every day towards harmony and balance. Who I am has expanded. Um, my awareness, my spirituality, my intellect. It's such an emphasis on the experiential. How can we as women support one another in a way that honors like, exactly and perfectly who we are? Social activism is, has always to me been a component of women's spirituality. Humans emerged in the Paleolithic three million years ago and there is a long development of culture but religion emerges during the Paleolithic. In the program, we have three areas of focus. We have women and world religions, feminism, ecofeminism, and activism, and women's mysteries, sacred arts, and healing. I think that one of the most pivotal things we provide is an opportunity for students to really delve inside and look at what is my unique contribution to this world. If you're seeking the voices that have been stifled and oppressed, alternative knowledge and spiritualities and religions and worldviews and philosophies, this is the place that you want to be.